This is a training video on Magento's URL rewrite management. Currently I have a problem with one of my uh, clients here. The name of the client is uh, shipoverseas.com and I'm having a problem with a particular page for Switzerland. This page up here, if you're able to see, has a keyword in the title and then it has a dash one. So shipping cart to Switzerland dash one dot HTML. I need to get rid of that, but I can't figure it out. So, actually I do know how to do it. I'm just shooting this for you guys. Okay, coming down here, we're going to want to sort by, um, because I mean, can you imagine trying to shuffle through 470 records? Okay, uh, I'm going to go to the United States. I know that's where the problem is. And then I'm going to type in Switzer. Hit enter. Or some of you could hit the search button. And this is where my problem lies. Going into my catalog here under categories. By the way, this is, uh, I built this uh, static website on an e commerce platform. So you're not going to see any products. Mine's lined up a little bit different. Okay. So uh, if I click on Switzerland here, you're going to see. And this is under all store views. Switzerland has an ID category of 63. Over here, ID category 63. Right. I've looked for category 61, and I cannot find it. So what probably happened was I duplicated it somehow, and then I deleted it. Maybe this one was kept. I don't know. Either way, my uh, Google Webmaster tools told me that I had a duplicate content issue somewhere for this particular URL that ends in shipping car to Switzerland dash one. Okay, so I know that my problem is coming from one of these two areas. United States, United States, and English. I'm assuming that if I change this one, category 61, you see here, that's what the URL should be, and that's what it's displaying. So if I try to change this uh, URL here and try to take out that dash one, I'm going to get an error. Okay, let's try to rewrite this, permanent 301 redirect. In case somebody built a link to that page, I don't know. Request pass for a specified store already exists. Okay, so this is our category path again. That's where it actually is. This one appears to be a duplicate or something. One that I deleted and then I started up another one. So this I have to I'm assuming I have to delete it. Oh my god. Let's see what happens before you do any of this crap. Copy your uh, Copy all your stuff into Notepad, just in case you know you have to do it again. You don't have to start all over from scratch. Okay. So I don't care about category 61. First off, it's not in my tree. Second, I need this URL, so I'm going to delete it. Are you sure you want to do this? I'm not 100% sure, but I'm almost positive. Otherwise, I wouldn't be making this training video. 
Okay, the only one left here is category 63. Do I want to do a redirect? Well, first off, let's check out to see what has happened so far. I close this window. Go back to the home page. Go straight to Switzerland. And we have the dash one still, obviously. Well, at least our page is still there, right? Okay, good. Take that dash one out. Runa 301, this one. Again, because someone might have built a link during the five minutes I've had this page up. And we are letting this reload. This page should uh, be changed into Switzerland 1 right now. Okay. Oh, hey, we got a 404 instead. This is not good. Good thing I saved this notepad. Change that back to redirect and stick that to no. Down in the status bar, I was able to see that it did say Switzerland. Here we go. So now everything's taken care of. Go back to the home page, see if anything was messed up. Nope. Come back here. Try it out one more time. You see, never freaking know with Magento. And my URL is now fixed. Shipping cart to Switzerland, and there is no dash one in this. Thank you very much. Donate five bucks or something, okay?